the perfect water conditions for flower horn fish in this video we'll have a comprehensive overview friends flower horn fish are popular among fish hobbyists because of their colorful appearance and playful personalities to keep this fish healthy and happy it's important to maintain the proper water parameters in their aquarium in this video we'll go over the ideal water parameters for flower horn fish and why they are important before starting this in detail let's welcome you all to our channel blue aquatics where you all get the best information about fish keeping friends talking about the temperature the ideal water temperature range for flower horn fish is between 78 and 82 degrees fahrenheit which is 25 degrees to 25 degrees celsius this temperature range is comfortable for the fish and promotes good health at temperatures below this range the fish may become sluggish and less active while temperatures above this range can be stressful and may lead to health problems it's important to note that sudden changes in temperature can be harmful to your fish if you need to adjust the temperature do so gradually over a period of several days to avoid shocking your fish next parameter is ph level the ph level is a measure of the acidity or alkalinity of the water The ideal pH level for flower horn fish is between 7.4 to 8.0 which is slightly alkaline. This range is important for the fish because it promotes good health and helps to maintain a stable environment. Flower horn fish are sensitive to changes in pH. So, it's important to keep the pH level consistent. Rapid changes in pH can cause stress and health problems for the fish. Regular water testing and maintenance can help ensure that the pH level remains within the ideal range for your flower horn. Now discuss about another very important parameter which is ammonia and nitrite levels. Friends, ammonia and nitrite are toxic compounds. that are produced by fish waste and uneaten food in the aquarium high levels of these compounds can be harmful to flower horn fish and can cause stress illness and even death to keep your flower horn healthy it's important to keep the ammonia and nitrite levels as close to zero as possible One way to keep these levels low is to perform regular water changes. A good rule of thumb is to change 10 to 20% of the water in tank every week. This helps to dilute any harmful compounds that may be present in the water. Another way to keep ammonia and nitrite levels low is to use a good quality filter. A filter can help to remove waste and debris from the water which can help to reduce the levels of these harmful compounds next comes is nitrate levels nitrate is a compound that is produced by the breakdown of ammonia and nitrite in the aquarium while nitrate is less toxic than ammonia and nitrite high levels can still be harmful to flower horn fish Nitrate levels should be kept below 40 ppm to ensure the health of your flower horn fish. One way to keep nitrate levels low is to perform regular water changes. This helps to dilute any nitrate that may be present in the water. Another way to keep nitrate levels low is to use live plants in the aquarium. Plants can help to absorb excess nutrients and can help to keep the water clean and healthy next comes is hardness 
friends water hardness refers to the amount of dissolved minerals such as calcium and magnesium in the water the ideal water hardness for flower horn fish is between 8 to 12 dgh water that is too hard or too soft can be stressful for the fish and can lead to health problems to maintain the proper water hardness you can use a water conditioner that is specifically designed for aquarium use these products can help to adjust the hardness of the water and can ensure that it remains within the ideal range for your flower horn in the end it is right to say that maintaining the ideal water parameters is crucial for the health and well-being of flower horn fish as a responsible fish owner it is your duty to monitor the water parameters regularly and take corrective actions if necessary keeping the water clean and well maintained is key to ensuring the long-term health and growth of your flower horn fish remember maintaining the right water parameters is not a one-time task but a continuous process you need to monitor the water parameters frequently and make necessary changes to ensure that the conditions remain optimal by following the tips and guidelines mentioned in this video you can provide your flower horn fish with a healthy and comfortable environment to thrive in that's all for now we hope that this video will be helpful and beneficial for you so do like it and subscribe to our channel blue aquatics and ring the bell icon so that you'll never miss any important update so stay tuned and have a healthy and happy flower on fish keeping